We took the Transocean Arctic uh, on hire in August, and since that time we have uh, we have populated the, the template with four wellheads. Uh, we have since drilled three of the wells, uh, with uh, installed both of the casing sections, and um, as of this morning, we have now landed, locked, and tested three Christmas trees uh, on the template. So today is a milestone for the project. All people on board the Transocean Arctic are here for one reason, and that is for drilling wells and now for Winter Sol Day Off. Together with Transocean, Arca Solutions and Oceaneering, key members of the Dvalin project team have been working around the clock to install the 52-ton Dvalin Christmas trees onto the wellheads. Yeah, yeah. Okay, maybe try and do that at night shift. Yes, we can. The rig, built in 1986, has a long history of working on subsea development projects. But Dvalin is one of the most challenging projects yet. Uh, some of the greatest challenges we've had so far on the project is uh, being able to use the Transocean Arctic for the complex subsea operation. Uh, there has been many modifications to the rig to prepare ourselves for running the equipment. It's uh, almost 400 meters down to the wellheads and we have big swells, waves, tide. The, the distance between the wellhead and the rig is constantly moving. So we need to compensate for that by using drill string compensators. So we have one on board here that can take 270 tons and compensate uh, heavy loads. So it will be still compared to the sea bottom. There are several steps in the process of installing the Christmas trees. With the tree running tool already suspended over the moon pool, the Christmas tree is slowly skidded down to be stacked together with the running tool. It's important to control the movement of the massive 52-ton load before it is deployed through the splash zone. Finally, the tree and running tool are run down on drill pipe and connected to the wellhead 400 meters below. The ROVs perform the final installation on the seabed, including a series of pressure tests. Performing a complex multidisciplinary operation on a rig in the Norwegian Sea requires a high level of coordination between all the parties involved. Yeah, I think it's important to mention that in order to deliver the success the project needs, um, one important element is uh, close collaboration with Transocean and the service companies on the rig. We all need to work together to make this happen. And of course, good communication is a key thing. Toolbox talks whenever needed. We have to stop and uh, check that everyone is online and know what they're going to do next. It moves us from the drilling phase into, in towards the completion phase. Um, so this is a huge step forward in the, in the progress of the project. We have a great team spirit and we work together in a one-team approach and that's really, uh, that's really working well for us. <laughs>